Welcome back to Beast and Fields Home Learning. Today we're going to be learning how to draw a ladybird. So as part of our home learning, you were asked to pick your favourite character from the story, What a Ladybird Heard. And my favourite character from the story is the ladybird. And I chose the ladybird because I love how she's so small that no one sees her and no one can hear her. So, and she sees everything with her eyes but nobody sees her because she's so small. So today we're going to be drawing a ladybird. So this is my waggle, and a waggle means what a good one looks like. So this is what we're going to be drawing today, boys and girls. Okay, boys and girls, so to make our ladybird drawing, we are going to need a pencil, a piece of paper, a black pen, and a red pen. If you don't have a pen of either of these colors, you can use coloured pencils, it's not a problem. So let's get started. So the first thing we're going to do is draw a circle for our ladybird body. So I'm going to hold my finger and thumb really closely to the bottom with my two fingers behind and I'm going to draw a circle. Doesn't matter if it's not a perfect circle. And then I'm going to draw the head. So I'm just gonna do a curvy line at the top, and that's my head. And then boys and girls, I'm going to draw the body wings. So the ladybird wings. So I'm going to draw a line in the middle and curve at the bottom. And then I'm going to curve on the other side. And then going to draw boys and girls, some eyes. So I need one, two eyes. So I'm going to draw one eye and two eyes. I'm also going to draw the antennas. So I'm going to draw one with a curved line, two with a curvy line, and then I'm going to draw two circles. So one circle on top and two circle on top. The next thing I'm going to draw, boys and girls, is the legs. So I'm going to draw one, two, three, four, five, six lines around the body. So I'm going to go one, two, three, four, five, six. Now I've spread them out so they're not all together. So make sure you put them far apart so they're not together. And then boys and girls on the line, I'm going to draw a circle on top. So one, two, three, four, five, and six. The next part boys and girls we're going to draw is the ladybird spots. So I'm going to draw six spots. So one, two, three, four, five, Six. Now you can draw more spots if you'd like. Miss Singh's just done six, but you can do as many as you want. So, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, boys and girls, and the last bit Miss forgot, Miss Singh forgot the ladybird's eyeball. So, one, two, and that's our ladyboy drawn, boys and girls. The next part is the fun part. We get to colour it in. So I'm going to do the red part first. So I'm going to get my red pen, put the lid on. If you don't have pens, boys and girls, you can use a red pencil.
there we have it boys and girls. That is our ladybird. So I hope you've had fun today and I hope that I can see your lovely ladybird or whatever you choose to draw from the story. I can't wait to see what you come up with and I can't wait to see how colourful and bright they are. So let's see what you can do and go off and try and do a different character from the story. So I hope to see you soon and don't forget to upload your pictures to Tapestry so me and the rest of the Beast and Fields team can see your lovely pictures. Take care and I'll see you soon. Bye!